Can you believe that we're stepping into the last month of 2023? For home buyers and sellers keen on staying informed, let's delve into the latest statistics shaping the national housing market. I'm Dave with the David Marshall team of VXP Realty, and I'm excited to break down the numbers for you with a focus on four key metrics. One, new listings. As of the most recent data from Redfin, new listings of homes for sale have experienced a modest rise of 0.3% this fall. While this might seem like a small increase, it's a noteworthy development, especially considering the ongoing challenge of low inventory in the market. This uptick marks the first noticeable change in listings since the summer of 2022. Two, home prices. Even with higher home mortgage rates in play, more homeowners are putting their homes on the market. This may be a reflection of the realization that elevated rates could persist or that lower buyer demand might lead to a decline in prices. For serious home buyers, this modest increase in listing provides a welcome expansion of choices. The average national home sale price currently stands at $412,502, showing a 2.2% change in the increase from last year. Three, mortgage rates. The national average 30-year fixed rate mortgage is currently at approximately 7.6% influencing the financial dynamics of both buyers and sellers. The average time it takes for a home to go pending is currently 33 days on the market. Four, supply. Nationally, the number of homes available for sale has decreased by 17% compared to last year. This places us in a slim 2.5 month scenario, firmly maintaining the seller's market status. The real estate landscape is inherently volatile, consistently evolving. This is Dave of the David Marshall team of VXP Realty. In this ever-changing market, we recognize the importance of local insights. If you're eager for the most up-to-date numbers specific to your area, then please contact us for our client-based approach to service excellence.